वेलकम टू माई चैनल व्यूवर्स इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो आई शोड यू हाउ टू डू दिस वोवन रोज नाम आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू द वोवन स्पाइडर स्टिच विच इज़ ऑल्सो वोवन स्टिच वर्क ओनली ऑन द सर्फिस सो दैर बी ओनली बेसिक फाइव स्टिचेज ऑन द फैब्रिक एंड देन एवरी थिंग एल्स इज गोइंग टू बी वर्क ऑन द टॉप सो वी विल बिगिन एग्जैक्टली लाइक हाउ वी बिगैन फॉर दिस वन सो वी आर गोइंग टू मेक दिस फर्स्ट will make the base stitches today i'm going to use the same colored thread for the base stitches as well as the weaving part just do five basic straight stitches as the base and after after you put this thread down here to make the last of the straight stitch bring it out very close to the center you can bring it out anywhere bring it out very close to the center like this so i've got it here here now what i'm going to do is i'm going to take it under this stitch and again under this stitch so i'm going to kind of wrap wrap this basic stitch with a stitch then again move under the next one and under the same one again this stitch is also called the spider web stitch because it looks like a spider web also can be used as a flag in any motif which i'm going to do right now so every time you take the thread under the base stitch and under it again before you move on to the next one so again under and under and like this we have to continue till we fill up fill up all the base stitches so let me do a little more and come back and show you how it looks so if you see i have done most of the weaving now so you have a choice at this stage either you can leave it just like that with these ends protruding or you can continue and fill it up till the very end so that that's again your choice how you want it to look but now if you see you'll come to know why it is called the spider web stitch it looks like a spider web so you can use it as flowers or you can actually use it as a spider web suppose you are illustrating the rhyme vinci vinci spider with uh, needlework then probably you can <laughs> use this spider web stitch to show the spider's web just an idea that came to my mind yeah i must take it up some day actually So I'm going to just fill it up right till the end. I hope you got the method. It is very similar to what we did yesterday, but again, not very, not exactly the same. so yesterday the woven rose was slightly difficult not difficult slightly different i mean as compared to this spider stitch spider wheel or spider web just going to do one last round and then i will go down and knot my thread and my flower will be ready so 
so now I'm going to end this here now to anchor it in place I'm going to place I've come out on this side of the thread right so I'm going to take it on the other side put the needle down and yeah that's it I'll knot the thread below and here my flower is ready so this was one woven stitch flower yesterday the woven rose and this is another woven uh, wo woven flower the spider web stitch I hope you like this stitch and I hope you'll try it someday thank you for watching